you will find few people who are willing to say that triple BE has not been a failure. It has not enabled broad-based empowerment. Instead, what it has done is enabled elite enrichment at the expense of the majority of South Africans. Triple BE has proven itself to be an ineffective method of promoting economic inclusion. We have said before that it is rooted in the idea of trickle-down redress, where corporates are used to transfer assets, positions, and contracts from one elite to another, without in fact promoting economic inclusion. Those who tend to benefit most from triple BE currently tend to either be politically connected, already financially well off, or they run uncompetitive businesses who provide goods and services to the state at an astronomical cost and who have little incentive to become more cost competitive. 